Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about concept of high airway obstruction syndrome imaging. This is the rare congenital anomaly, anomaly of the airway with complete intrinsic laryngeal and or trachea obstruction. Result in dysfunctional and hyper expanded one. We will teach hemi diaphragm and gaja venous compression with ascites hydro. Most common signs and symptoms in urethro, like malatral, echoistic lungs, similar to mass, with ascites. At birth, severe respiratory distress, aponia, and fail intubation. Intimating, usually in life's lung, threaten or awaited diaphragm, prenatal imaging, because or T2 hyperintense. Mm -hmm. Lung with dilated fluid field trachea, inferior to obstructing lesion, plus minus fully hydromyosis. Sign of obstruction appear as persistent source or long sequence of absent airway fluid at or below glutis. Central line compressed hand. Limited motion of abnormal diaphragm, abdominal distension with large volume of scientists, finding a lesion with stenosis, membrane perforation, or fistula. Here is T2 of a 20 weeks so the classic feature of congenital high area absorption syndrome, including uniform hyperexpansion of the lung, averted diaphragm, and ascites. There is a long segment right here occlusion with dilated of the lower thoracic trachea and central airway. This is the AP radiograph of the newborn. So mark abdominal distension due to ascites, the pleural fusion, and chest wall edema consistent with hydro. The hemi diaphragm are uh, flattened. Tracheostomy was placed during an C procedure. Right para sagittal ultrasound of global thoracic upper abdomen is in the same patient, so an abnormal inverted and black diaphragm, which is not moved during exam. The plural shooting and ascites are noted. Transcolor local ultrasound of the same patient let us have 20 weeks chest is known. Each so compression of the heart by enlarged hyperechoic gland, note the dilated central airway. T2 on R in a fetus at 20 weeks success station, so dilated fluid distended bronchite and trachea. 
up to the ladder. The image of arm are evaded and the lens so diffuse high signal intensity is a large volume of oscillations. Again, this is the T2 of in the same patient. So the dilated fluid field packing in large and high signal intensity line with flattened Japan and ascites in this patient do. Yeah. Congenital high airway absorption signal. The oligotranosis was due to renal anomaly. Thank you.